This is the story of Kendall Forest, locally owned for decades, then sold to an investment group and threatened by fragmentation and change of land use. This same story is happening in communities nationwide and affects jobs, ecosystems, and traditions. The loss of our working forests is the biggest conservation challenge in the U.S. today. But we can change that. For the most part, we're forgotten up here. And everybody just survives day to day. A lot of the people have been at their jobs for 30, 40 years. It's the most heavily forested area in New York State outside of the Adirondack Park and the Catskills. The population that has lived here, it's important for them to protect that resource. The forest industry has always been a big part of the Adirondack and Tug Hill regions. It's a small knit community. Everybody knows each other. People on Tug Hill have always been kind of uh, land rich and cash poor, so just keeping their land and being able to make a living off the land continues to be a challenge. The whole forest economy has shifted and is still uncertain how that's going to play out, but you do have places like Hardened Furniture that are staying strong and trying to continue to invest in the community and keep the jobs local, which I think is a great thing. We have uh, big land contractors coming in and they're subdividing these out these big parcels out into five ten acre lots they don't think about the next generation they don't think about the environmental impact if you've eliminated the forest and the community as a whole the wilderness as a whole it's not going to be the same thing for the future of the community future of the surrounding communities i think it's important that we preserve some of these properties and I think this is one of the, the big things that we are looking to do here. Some of this land is going for top dollar and communities can't afford to buy it, you know. So to have a group like this to turn to and it has the same, same outlook and the same views on saving these kind of places, I just think it's a wonderful thing. The Conservation Fund's role is to understand the community's needs and how it relates to the, the land itself and then to act as an intermediary, to be a bridge owner of the forest, to secure it, and give the amount of time it takes to, to come up with a permanent conservation solution. So this came on our radar as a key piece that we're, the local community was really interested in conserving as a solid block of working forest. There was initially some, some pushback from some of the local community, mostly because there was uncertainty as to what was going to happen once the state owned it and it became open to the public. I believe we have the support of the community now and, and they're excited to see that property open and available for their use um, and, and the continued economic benefit to the local community as well. If everything has gone well, I mean, it's not just to preserve it, but to have it still function as logging, as hunting and fishing, so people can enjoy it. It's now open and available to all of the people of the state of New York, as it's owned by the DEC, for people to come up and recreate, whether it's camping or hiking or snowmobiling in the winter time. So I think a lot of people can benefit from it. Especially in a place like Redfield, where you do have some businesses and you're bringing tourists in, or snowmobilers, recreationists, it's another boost to that tourism economy, if you will. The Kendall Track connects two existing state forests, Battle Hill State Forest and Salmon River State Forest. So combined, that's a huge tract of land um, that's going to be maintained as a forested landscape for the foreseeable future. There are a lot of wildlife species that depend on that unbroken forested landscape. I really hope that the town of Redfield and the town of Orwell and the greater community can, can use this project because as a springboard even um, at, for more potential conservation projects where it fits. It has worked out for the better, for the better of the town, better for, the, for that peat, for the forest, and for the next generation. The Conservation Fund invests in communities and regions for long-term sustainability that benefits people, the environment, and the economy. We protected and transferred the 3,236-acre Kendall property to the New York State Department of Environmental Conservation, securing this forest as a working landscape for generations to come.